I want to get I want to get that belt back and uh, fighting the toughest guys in the division is the is the way to do that. Um, you know, I, I don't I don't take that loss, that last loss and and think you know I I need to beat some guys who aren't on my level up um, to get my confidence back. You know, I felt like I, I know exactly what I did wrong in that last fight and uh, what I have to do differently. Um, so I don't need to fight any guys to get my confidence level up. I feel like Musashi is a great fight for me to to uh, get back on a, on the on my winning ways and get closer to fighting for the title again. This next fight is um, a lot of mistakes I've made in the last two fights. So th this next fight is going to be a lot a lot different. You know, it's going to be just kind of going back to the old me. He's an I think he, what he brings to the table. He's an experienced guy. He fights like he's experienced. You know, he's very he stays calm in all situations. Um, but I'm gonna I'm gonna make him panic. Uh, when he fights me, um, I, just, I really feel like it's a great fight. My wrestling is definitely better than him, and I think my jujitsu is better than his. So once we hit the floor, I don't think he's ever gone against a guy like me. Yeah, Gina Carano was the face of women's MMA, and when she went out, Ronda became the face of MMA. Now that Ronda's out, I would love to be that person. I would love to be that role model for these little uh, girls that are looking up to me or looking up for someone to look up to. Um, I would love to fill that role, and I would love to be the face of women's MMA, absolutely. Right. 